hello guys welcome to my channel so today's topic is going to be what type of love you are attracting in your life right now so we have three options to choose from um, option number one is a green heart option number two is red heart and option number three is blue heart so choose your option and I'll see you at your party yes you can choose more than one options but um, always uh, choose what what um, what option you are most drawn to because that's the messages that you need to really hear and okay let's start with your reading hello option number one so green heart you chose this green heart so this is going to be a reading so when i drew this green heart i feel like you are manifesting or attracting the type of love I said manifesting so you are into manifesting okay and this is like a small heart you you just want someone to generously love you as the way you are okay um, um, option number one by one so I feel like there is something you okay A channel some messages for you it's really hard for you to really uh, tell what's going on with you it's it's like it's a really hard for you to opening up so you are really reserved type of a person pile number one it's because you are the giver type of energy I feel like you are very generous very kind very beautiful so and you always there for others you always take care of others need and how others needs and others feelings like you always are very cautious um, you know, when it comes to other people's feeling because you know how it really affects us when someone said something really wrong or someone doesn't respect your feelings you know very well it's like um, the type of love you're manifesting is like it's um it's a uh, very pure not just like it's like you are loving that person's souls you are just going to be there for uh, that person and you are just expecting that in return um, it's like you don't have a lot of expectations from the person you are going to be with and this is like you are just you just want that person to be very honest with you honest with their feelings for you you just want the person who actually wants to take care of you and who just um, respect your feelings who is there to listen like what you have to say like uh, you want someone you can uh, tell how you feel you can you you can easily speak up your mind too okay and they won't judge you or anything for your feelings okay you could be very emotional you are a very emotional person by number one and i feel like um you you could be um, a water sign i strongly feel pisces energy so you could be a pisces scorpio or um oh Pisces, Scorpio, oh, I feel Capricorn also, I don't know, I feel Capricorn energy as well, okay, let's see, what else you need to know, what type of um, love you are attracting in your life, mm, okay, we have one card, we have the eight of wands, we have the five of cups, Okay. okay, we have the moon card. Hmm. We have the ace of pentacles. What I feel like... Okay. What I feel for you by one is... The messages I receive is like... You want someone to... Okay, you want someone... You, you want someone that... You are attracting type of love that you don't have to say uh, what's going on in your, your in your mind or what you are feeling. Uh, you, the person you are manifesting, the type of love you are manifesting, it's like that for the the okay. 
your love interest the person you are meant to be with so your person sees you and they 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 would instantly know like what you are feeling what you are thinking if you like this thing or not you, you just don't you just don't you want that kind of a soul connection that you don't have to say anything but they get it what you want to say okay and it's like with the five of cups and the moon card and the ace of pentacles it's like there is a really like you have so much love to offer pal one and you, you are just now waiting you you just realize how it's important for you to um, protect your energy and you are not giving yours your energy or your emotion or your time to anyone okay because there is like a, you had a kind of a past where people use you for your kindness and use you for your uh, you know uh, true emotions like how you're feeling there there kind of a situation I feel like someone had said about like oh, you are too emotional you are not uh, very rational you are overly emotional you're overreacting just because you're expressing yourself like emotions and feelings are very vital part for your relationship and the type of love you're expecting it's like you want someone to expect accept you as the way you are you don't want to change yourself you are you want someone to ex uh, uh, understand your feelings why you behave certain way why you are uh, so emotional why do you feel so emotions okay and if you see this eight of wands and the moon card we have this green energy here so you have very open heart chakra okay pal one and um with the five of cups i feel like sometimes you think of what people have said to you in the past about your emotion like you still rem remember the harsh things that people have said to you because okay they, they were just being mean to you okay why this five of cups is here we have the eight of swords and the queen of wands okay we have the strength card and we have the queen of swords and they have bottom of the deck we have the three of cups so what i sense uh, pile one it's like there there are there are the time in your life where you have like friends or group of people i mostly feel feminine energy from uh, that the, uh, from uh, them uh, it could be like a feminine energy a very very confident person but uh, there are people who who may have make fun of you because of how you feel emotionally and could be your family member or there are some people in your life they were just very strict and they were not that emotional as the way you are and you are like why it's so hard for me to find love and it's it's your energy is really overpowering this reading and it's kind of cause you this eight of sword energy where you find a kind completely kind of a your it, it's like you completely lost your self confidence in some senses it's not like you are not confident enough in your abilities but it's some so you felt like you have to act in a certain way otherwise you will be called as a weak person okay and with the queen of wands and strength and queen of sword energy there are some okay there is some some female in your life she is very uh, supportive of you or but she is very strict in nature and uh, now i feel like you are realizing why that that person is being strict with you or just uh, telling you to behave in certain way i, I feel like you are just developing the sense like where you uh, where you can um, like how to express your emotion and how much to feel them it's like you are creating that balance and i feel like the person you are attracting the type of love you are attracting that person is going to really help you uh, to like make that balance if not if that person has not entered in your life yet or it if you are male and if you are watching for a female and it's she is going to be very supportive she is very empathic 
uh, towards you but she has that balance okay so you are attracting someone who has that emotional balance okay and that person is going to uh, tell you how or teach you or they are just going to inspire you like how you are going to be um balance as emotionally as well they are not going to judge you for your emotions they see your strength this tree see your strength uh, within how much you feel emotion even if you are very like a very sensitive person but you could be very you are there are other qualities that they they will see you okay you want you you want someone that let's see how like the, the different aspects of you different qualities you have but there are like a few people who know who true who you truly are and the person you are attracting it's like uh, the type of love you're attracting like this person is going to be your best friend okay they're just going to involve you in uh, everything that do and they, they, they would like to spend more time with you and they, they will just like just come join us with me and it's, it's they are going to um, help you socialize you know get to know different people it's not like you're introvert or anything you could be introvert if i said that um, but they're just going to introduce you with different people they're just going to make you feel like you are very loved and in wanted and the i think they have this kind of a group of people they are very supportive and they are very uplifting okay they are going to introduce you with uplifting people that there there are people who respect you and um, they they admire your strength and you they admire you as the way you are with the ace of pentacles i feel like the person you are attracting is going to help you achieve your dreams or goals so they are going to be very supportive of your dreams and goals if you want to be very independent if you want to start your own business if you are currently doing something if you are just if you want to focus on your career they, they are going to they, they are going to um, sub, they are going to be very supportive of you they will they could be uh, there would be a time when you if you need like a help like financially or anything they will provide for you they won't be shy if you are more successful than them okay so can you clarify the ace of pentacles so now we know okay with the six of i i told you so this person is going to be very supportive of you okay if you need money if you need anything like if you need any kind of helps or uh, even it just like uh, you know it's a moral support thing they're going to be there for you okay they see your strength they see you how smart you are okay they see how talented you are in your work of field okay um someone has very creative uh, creative spirit okay you could be very creative and you have like uh, this artistic expression that you want to like show to the world they are going to encourage you to show how uh, artistic you are they, they are just going to help you that you just go out there and just make yourself known for your um, creativity okay it's like you have this skill that they are going to help you to just you know get just um, um, um it's like a get uh they, they will introduce you with some people who are on this uh, same journey okay if you want to like uh, learn some extra skills or anything that is related for to your career they are going to be very supportive of you okay by one you are manifesting a very supportive person okay let's see what type of love by one is attracting in their life okay oh my god we have the king of swords okay high priestess in reverse and we have the queen of Pen queen of cups and the world card and the three of ones bottom of the deck we have ten of swords okay there will there will be no secrets okay there will be no secrets in your relationship with the high priestess i feel like 
uh, this the person you are manifesting could be very logical okay they are very logical person but it's not like they are only based on logical they are also spiritual but they express themselves as they are very logical person okay they keep their mind and like uh, intuitive knowledge in balance okay they check their fact before they say anything okay maybe when you first introduce to this person or this type of love when they enter in your life they might trigger you some you know past emotions that is within you they might be very um, oh, um, what the word I was looking for they are, they are kind of like uh, you know too much to handle you will feel like it's not it's not going to be my person okay but they just want to they just want best for you okay and with the queen of cups energy they this person may come off as very over over overpower why am i saying overpower so this person is really like a masculine energy it doesn't matter the gender it's not like a masculine only but they are very uh, very much like uh, very in tune with their mind okay they are very logical very firm person okay so they could be very authoritative and but they have this queen of cups energy so they are very balanced person it's not like they are going to be harsh with their words but they are very emotional and it's important that they are going to be very emotional towards you okay they are just like have this so much love to offer to give and but for other people they are just going to be very like a cold person or cool calm collected who don't show a lot of emotions is it's going to be like they are going to be just soft for you okay and there will be no secrets between you and this person and this person could be a um, uh, air sign i mostly feel like aquarius and gemini and they could have libra also in their chart a lot so they they are very good with their words okay and this person could also have a called capricorn in their chart okay and the queen of cups it could, this could be you okay hmm. okay this could be let me see this is like uh, for someone out there it's like a specific message there is uh, like uh, the fear you have that your person could be there would be no cheating or uh, any third party situation will ever create it okay you don't have to worry about repeating the past kind of a thing okay it's like they are just going to be oh for you that's kind of a love you're attracting that this person has only eyes of love for you okay they they, they would never have feelings for any other person but just you okay you are just their center of the world you are their world with the three of uh, three of um three of wands and the world card you guys definitely travel different different places together okay this person will love to take you with them like they are not afraid to show you um show you to the world you know they are just going to be very proud of you like this is my wife this is my husband like this, this is going to be their wife like this is this is my person okay they are not going to afraid like uh, they are not um they are just very really, they are going to be very um confident you know because confident and they are just going to be very like a proud because they are in relationship with you okay huh, they they love to show you off and their relationship and you won't see that right away but i feel like this person is going to be very like a uh, pda person okay they will just hold your hand and then they're just like they are going to be very lovey-dovey you will be surprised to see their reaction because they they generally not just the, the not like that and you want to like equal give and take relationship so it's going to be that for sure okay and this person always wants best for you so they will advise you uh, they will give you advices they will show you where you are uh, show you your uh, weaknesses or they may they may try to like tell you how you can improve yourself or things like that it's not like they are just going to 
show your weaknesses or they love to tease you or anything like that they just want best for you so they are not going to be very harsh with their words they are going to be very sensible like what to say what to know like they are just going to know how they should treat you right okay so they are going to treat you right so anything else what uh, type of love file one is attracting okay this this person would love to talk to you okay just I feel like it. just yeah the tower can you clarify the tower here okay it's piece of pentacles and the hangman with the four of uh, cups oh four of cups in the bottom of the deck the queen of pentacles six of swords and uh, Okay, the person you are attracting is not going to be fed up with you. Okay, pile one. They are going to wait for you. They are going to respect you. They will never try to make you like go fast, do it fast. I want this, I want that. They are not going to rush you into things or into relationship. Um, you guys going to take a, take a, take time to get to know each other. Okay, you guys could... Uh, date for like years and they will then you will progress things into marriage or something very solid it's not like they are going to walk away from you it's like you need that kind of re reassurance by one that the person you love kind of left and they are just always going to be reassuring you or showing you that they are not leaving you or they are you are the only one that they want they need in their life with the page of pentacles they see that you are very loyal person and the person you are attracting is also very loyal so they are not going to walk away from you they will not do anything that hurts you okay that will hurt you anyways because they will not like uh, uh, something about like you have had like a very um, painful experiences in your relationship where okay it's very specific that you may have have experience by cheating by your partner and but it's not going to happen with this person okay that kind of love you are attracting it's not going to repeating ever okay with the four of cups universe is literally giving you the person that you are meant to be with so you don't worry about that and that person is also waiting for someone's they they uh, they feel loved with okay and this person is very spiritual also and they are also logical but they are also very spiritual they are very tuned in tune with their emotions so they are they are going to know like how you feel and what you what uh, what to what to do in a situation okay they are going to be very patient with you they are going to be very um, patient and very like uh, gentle with you okay they will never make you feel that you are not their equal okay there is something about being equal here like they will always be very generous towards you okay because they they want to they will let their guard down for you okay by one i feel like there is you need like this emo they they will okay this person is very much in love with you that they will do anything to make you feel that you you can trust them okay this person is normally like a, normally does not like to explain themselves a lot okay they're like you you want to think whatever you want to think about me i don't care okay they don't care about people's opinion but they care about you so they are just going to make sure that what you feel for them okay they want they 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 will always try their best so that you can um be with them okay this person has the same kind of a feeling as you are feeling and one anything else what type of love and is attracting in your life oh we have the 
two of cups. This person is your soulmate. With the nine of cups. Yes. We love fortune. Can you clarify the spiral swords? Can you clarify the spiral swords? The star and the nine of swords. Okay. Bottom of the deck, we have the justice. So this person is, you are manifesting, you are attracting your soulmate, okay? Your soul connection with the Knight of Cups. They have so much love for you. They are going to be very patient with you. They will never raise their voice at you, okay, pile one. They are going to be very patient, very loving, very understanding person that you are manifesting, attracting in your life. Manifesting, you could be into manifesting. Um, and the star card. Um, I feel like they people would be jealous of your relationship or the type of love you are attracting by one. So you don't have to worry about the consequences of like what other people are thinking about you. Even they are even if they are jealous because you are always protected with the star and knight of swords. The love that you are attracting is because you deserve this kind of a relationship. Okay, pile one, you deserve the person who is like you deserve to be with your soulmate, with the love of your life. So don't feel that way that you don't deserve it because you deserve this with the knight or the star and knight of swords. The whatever the pain that you have been through, it's for the better. It's like they are. It's like uh, it's not. It's not like uh, the suffering is better, but they are just preparing you to be into this relationship. With this person is going to be very fulfilling and emotionally stable and this person if you are asking like when when this is exactly happening it's when uh, it's very unexpectedly they will enter your life and I feel like you are about to ending uh, about to end um, about to end an important cycle where you have to deal with like a past for people's emotions and I think there are some envious people people in your life that when they leave this when you leave this toxic cycle that's when this person will enter your life that's when this relationship will enter your life the star card and the knight of swords you are going to also um, make some important significant changes in your career especially when you feel like you are just uh, being uh, getting a raise or promotion or this there's a significant improvement in a career that is a positive change when you expect that shift that's when this person is going to enter your life and as i already mentioned this person could be a libra also with the justice card and i feel like they are going to marry that person marry this person okay so I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope this message resonates with you. And if you like this reading, uh, if you feel like it's resonated with you, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Hello, pal two. So you chose this green heart, uh, red heart. This is going to be your reading. So if you are drawn to pile one or green heart, you can watch that reading as well. Huh. So. Before I start your reading, I channel some messages for you. While looking at this heart, this is like you are waiting for the one. Okay, you are waiting for that one person that you want to spend your last, rest of your life with. It's like you are waiting for the knight and uh, the shining armor to like, you know, the, the love of your life to enter your life. It's like you are waiting for that right person and while looking at this heart you have gone through a very hard experiences in life like very harsh things that happened to happen to you in the past it's like you have built yourself over again and again and again when the the, the experiences that kind of broke your heart broke your uh, broke yourself broke you and it's like you picked up yourself again and again you picked up your heart again and again and you just try you're healing you're doing everything possibly can and you're hoping for better things to happen to you and in love life you are like experiencing you're in your love life you're experiencing like this beautiful beginning in your life it's like you want that one person to come in your life and you don't want any breakups or any separation after that you're just waiting for that one person and you you might not into dating 
you know casual dating and stuff like that you're just waiting for the right person to mr right miss right to come into your life okay let's see what else we have um, for you so what type of love file two is attracting in their life We have the first card is King of Swords in reverse with the Four of uh, Pentacles, a Sun card. Why the King of Swords in reverse? We have the Tower and uh, we have the Six of Wands. Right? Let's see. Why the King of Swords in reverse? In the tower and the six of wands. Like someone is waiting for their ex to come back in their life. It's like something like this. I feel like you are you are attracting a new person. Okay, pile number two. And it's like you have this hope in your heart that this person, the person that you are thinking of right now. It could be your ex-person will enter in your life. Like they will change themselves. They will realize what they have done. And they just come as new person. I don't feel like this is going to happen. It's like uh, six of wands is showing me that a new person is coming into your life. Which is going to be way better than the past person. Or it could be like uh, it's um oh. And also, I feel like uh, it's a very specific message. Like, I feel like some of you um, have recently lost your recently or, uh, or it could be a long time ago. You have lost uh, someone uh, dear to you, okay, your loved one. And it's kind of like a breaking point of everything that has happened to you. It was like a collapsing moment that you have to build your build yourself again to be with this a six of wands energy. You are like uh, completing. You are just uh, chasing down all the hardships and you are just rising, rising above to all uh, rise rising above of all this uh, negativity that has happened to you, all the challenges that you have to face till far, and. Four of Pentacles and the Sun card and the um, Two of Cups. This is this is the this is the connection that you are manifesting. It's very healing. Okay, pile number two is going to be very healing, very uplifting. You are going to be feel very joyful. Even like your inner child is going to be healed as well. This person is going to be very possessive over you with the four of pentacles. And we have the two of cups energy. So they are, they are definitely going to feel that you are their soulmate. And you are going to feel the same for them. Okay. And I feel like they are not it's it's like your past doesn't matter to them like whatever happened to them they're just going to be admiring the fact that you have uh, faced so much trouble in your life and you're still standing your ground they're just going to be very proud of you for just being so brave and just fighting for all fighting all this alone and they're just going to be like very proud of you okay you're just going to be their son you're just going to be there like a smile the reason for them to smile okay you are very important for this person with the four of pentacles i don't feel like it's a like a toxic like a possessiveness but they are just going to be very protective over you because they feel like you you need to be protected you are just very adorable okay by number two and with the sign uh, with the with the world and the queen of pentacles so you are just going you are very um, beautiful okay we still have the two of cups in the bottom of the deck um they are just going to be like you are very precious to them you are very gorgeous okay you are very beautiful file number two and you're beautiful gorgeous handsome you are just very charming and attractive and the person you are manifesting is going to be the same way okay they are also very uh, very uh, very much uh, charismatic and attractive 
they may have a lot of suitors okay they may have a lot of admirers they are very successful in their career in their life and they are just waiting for uh, the one also okay they are just waiting for you to come just to appear in their life okay and with the queen of uh, pentacles and the world card they see your improvement i just uh, okay improvement of they they see you how important you are to them okay and with the world card this could be this be person uh, may also be in a public eye okay okay <sighs> maybe it's a person that have had lost someone or they are not uh, talking to someone that they love that they can't reach out to that person it's about that person if it's not resonating with you okay let me see what else like what type of love i do is attracting seven of pentacles in reverse once you okay put the four of cups and uh, two of cups again we have two of cups again and we have the like seven of cups energy okay as i already mentioned that this person could have a lot of options okay they are very attractive and not most they and this person is very uh, intelligent okay they are very smart they know why so they they can read people okay they are very good at reading people if they are working in a field where they have to talk to a lot of individuals and they are very experienced like of uh, how people are reacting how people are feeling and what the intention behind the every motives that people around them has okay they are very aware of that situation so even if they are into that very glamorous um, or really like they are very social so they are just going to be yours okay they are not going to look for anyone else but you okay there 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 are times that people just confessing them how they feel they are just other people may also proposing to them or things like that but they are just going to say no i'm just waiting for my person okay i'm not going to take any cup unless it's my person okay that's what i feel it and with the seven of pentacles i feel that they you don't have to wait for things okay you don't have to uh, wait for uh, them give you compliment or uh, they you don't have to wait for like them taking efforts for you they are going to make sure that you are taken care of they are going to make sure that you are uh, you are loved supported taken care of with the two of cups i feel like you are the moment you attract this person in your life they are just going to uh, take care of you even more they are just going to involve in your life they are just going to they just want to help you in everything that they can do okay they will they, they will just make sure that you are uh, happy that's that the, that's the main energy i feel like they just don't want you to be in this waiting energy they will help you they will be like they okay the that the moment you attract this relationship you are going to experience a lot of good luck coming to your life it's like uh, and, it's, and it's like everything is going to start to work out for you as soon as you are with that person and it's same as for them like you are you both are uh, going to be very much like this positive field of energy that is attracting a lot of abundance into your life okay you are going to be very abundant and very prosperous as a couple and what type of love of well, two is experience okay attractive with the hangman and we have the queen of wands again the page of wands to reverse 
Ace of Pentacles, Hermit, and Nine of Nine of Wands. Like why the Page of Wands is in reverse? The Four of Swords. Pile two, you will realize that all this time that you waited for this one person to come in, it was it was worth it. That's what you're going to feel like. Maybe you feel stupid for giving chance to people who are not even yet at your level. Okay? That's what I feel like with the Four of Swords. I feel like you're just going to go into the past while well, just looking for the memories where you gave the chance to the wrong people or something like that. It's just, you're just going to be like, why did I even think of doing that? <laughs> With the hermit, I feel like you are a Virgo. This person is a Virgo. This person is very highly spiritual. They have a very, they are very wise. Okay, even they, even if they look very young for their age, they are a very wise person. Okay, this person, um, maybe uh, Aries also. Okay, it's a high possibility that could be a Aries, a fire sign, the Ace of Pentacles. You are going to make a lot of progress with. Uh, together okay with the ace of pentacles and the hermit and nine of swords why the nine of swords is here nine of swords is here with the five of cups and the magician I feel like this person will rarely uh, let you know if they are sad or they are depressed because they don't want to see you sad or things like that because with the five of cups and with the nine of swords even if they are feeling anxious or they are just not having a good day or uh, it's like they are just going through a tough period of time they won't let you know that easily that they are feeling not they are not feeling well or things kind of like that you are both going to heal each other's wounds okay it's like the past both of you may have like uh, something that really haunts you till this day you're just going to heal each other with the magician card and i think they are this person is already manifesting you in their life okay What else? What type of love Palto is attracting? I would say you have to be uh, careful with their feelings as well. By number two, you have to know if they are like, you have to uh, take some efforts to know like if they are sad or you just, you just need to just ask them if they, they want to talk to. Otherwise, they won't let you know if they are sad or things like that. All right, the three of swords. Why the three of swords is here? With the eight of cups, the two of wands, with the judgment star and three of swords, and three of swords is clarified by the eight of cups. They, this person or you, have the fear of uh, leaving behind the person you love the most. It's like. It's, it's the feeling I get here with the judgment and heart. Mm. Hmm. Or it's also like uh, when people or people around you and this person will know that you you guys are in a relationship or in a couple as a couple when you introduce like when you tell the world that you are you guys are together they are going to be very like a heartbreak kind of situation happen for other people that who admires your person or you okay it's like with the judgment card and the eight of cups and this person mirrors the emotions you have okay the emotions you carry if you feel like that this person will let you or things like that they're just going to feel the same way the more you heal pile two the more this person going to reflect or react the same way as you are 
okay the more you heal the more this person heal as well i don't know but you guys have a very intense connection and uh, with the six of swords i feel like you are already going through a major healing you are just looking at the past right now like what happened and yeah now you are prepared to conquer your world okay with the two of wands if you feel like any insecurity within yourself like you are not enough or anything that person is going to reflect the same way so it's like the more you heal the more you feel love within yourself the, that person is going to feel same way okay it's like a day of cups this person and you love your self-respect the moment you guys know that you are not respected in in that in that particular place or within that group you just you guys leave okay they are they have the same attitude as the way you are okay very powerful individual but with very emotional as well and anything else and uh, this person is right now they are moving uh, excuse me for the nuts um, this person is uh, already moving away from things that they that, that doesn't serve them anymore uh, with the three of swords i feel like this person is uh, right now feeling uh, feeling like they should not uh, let the negativity consume their life okay it may also be like if they um, some of them have already um, walking away from a relationship that they feel like they were the one or they, okay they are just walking away from those people any kind of a toxicity any kind of heartbreaking situation because they know like they deserve better and things like that okay they are also on their healing journey i mean this but i i definitely feel like the the moment um the the moment when they feel that they are healed okay they are ready for a new connection this person will enter your life you will just stumble upon them you will guys meet very like uh, on a divinely guided time okay with the eight of swords i think oh yeah with the magician that i feel like this person is already manifesting you i feel like this person may know you already okay i okay it may be also like you you guys have a, like a past life connection and now you guys meeting again like past life it's not have to be past like past past but it's like a past life connection like this is a past life connection for both of you guys and this person you are you can expect a com communication from them i feel like they will start a conversation or something and you will know instantly that this is your person with the magician card they are already manifesting you so if you like this reading let me know i'll see you next time bye hello pile number three so you chose this blue heart this is going to be your reading yeah this heart looks very unusual there is a reason behind it i channel some message by looking at this heart it's like communication is like key for you a communication is key in your relationship it's like very vital important part in your relationship or any connection that you ever had and you love to talk and this person is going to love to talk as well and it's like you always have to be like give 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 to other people you have to understand like other people like you over explain yourself and this is kind of like you want someone to matches your energy to matches your skills like you matches your communication style and that person is going to be exactly like that they, they are just going to match your vibe and energy they are just going to be very talkative uh, to you i feel like that this person is not talkative to other person but when it comes to you it's going to be non-stop okay they're just going to talk to you about anything and i feel like oh it's a very specific message but you are already working with them 
you are in like uh, working in the same field or something and some of you or you already know this person okay let's see um, yeah this is very specific message for someone so you may you know this person we have the devil card yeah with the work situation i feel like you guys are working together or you will be working together uh, okay once you guys are together i feel like and the strength card and what type of love boundary is attracting yes I hear like no BS type, again no crap, you you want like a straightforward connection where you don't have to do like uh, all this uh, people pleasing kind of a thing, like you want someone to be uh, in a proper relationship, you are like a hair of, with the hair of an, I feel like it's like you're kind of manifesting uh, or attracting, why am I saying manifesting a lot? Okay, your type of love attracting the type of love is like going to be very, this person, I hear like a traditional word, but I don't know what traditional means to you. So is it going to be very like a traditional type of a setting? Like they're going to give you a lot of time, okay? They are just going to make sure that they, they give you enough time. And with the Knight of Swords and Devil and the Hierophant. And this person is very career oriented so as you are. And I feel like you guys love to like uh, see improvements. And like continuously evolving. You're continuously developing. You have like a creative mind. You have like not like a, just like a creative like a painting. But you have like you're, you have this out of box thinking. And... Huh. You may have the humor that no, not uh, many people understand like but this people this person is going to get you okay they have like a same type of sense of humor as you are okay they, you are you guys are just very compatible when it comes to your talking and skills and abilities like they are just you you guys matches each other very well and you are just wide just you, you just get along together with the strength and eight of cups and six of uh, cups is like sometimes you feel like you are hard to handle and so as this person feels i don't know you guys are like the same and uh, yeah they're, they're just going to get you you're not too much to handle for them okay they're just this 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 person is going to very understanding they're just going they, they just know what what to say what to do to make you happy like how to make you feel comfortable okay with the eight of cups and uh, the six of cups you are just waiting for you're you're not just uh, looking for the empty cups that that people may try to offer you so you're not into that people pleasing anymore you're just wanting a real connection with the six of cups i feel like this person is going to be very like understanding they they when you are you are with this person you are just going to remember your childhood okay it's very specific you are just going to get this nostalgia kind of a feeling uh, you may get like a deja vu when you are with this person is you're just going to be like have we already met somewhere it's like you guys going to feel like it's like you have been together for so long it's kind of a feeling okay you will quickly develop a beautiful connection with this person because like you oh the king of cups can you like what type of love five days attracting in your life hmm. with the five five three i feel like can you clarify the king of cups i feel like you have to you will go you're going to have a choice you're going to you're going to try you're going to get a choice between two person people yeah that's a uh, very specific but take what resonates with you can you clarify the five one hmm. 
there it's like uh, two people are competing to get your attention with the four card yeah, it's like a new beginning and the both of these people both of this person are going to be uh, new okay it's not someone from the past with the uh, king of pentacles with nine of swords yeah i feel like when the the connection that you want to have for like the rest of your life like finally entered in your life it's like that's when the other person like other compatible partners try to come back in come uh, try to make their appearance in your life as well and it's like um and it's going to be up to you like who do who you choose because like the the person that i was talking about it's uh i think it's like a, this king of cups energy and they have already built a, like a long-term connection with you they're just planning very much like what to what's like next five years is going to be like with you they're just going to plan ahead like before you, I'm not just giving you, I'm just saying, saying like, hmm. you are have, you are like uh, entering and stepping up into this fresh energy pile number three. That's why you're just attracting like many possibilities. I would say with the nine of wands, it's like you're going to be like confused, like who to choose at certain point of your time. It's like you're finally attracting, as finally being this I don't change, I attract type of energy. You are working on that and it's going to be very like, um, okay, some incident will happen with you. It's not like a bad thing like even like you will be recognized for your work or you will be famous or you will be like a known or be wanted by the people around you and that's when you just attract a lot of opportunities like a lot of a person a lot of other um, other other people in your life it's like they're going to admire you because of your success and what you do and how you look and what your energy is but uh, then it's up to you like who to choose this person will definitely make you feel like home okay this person will let you be this a uh, full energy they will be uh, be like you are you always have to be very like uh, uh, responsible you have you are like very busy you have too much burden to carry on your shoulder and when this person comes in your life you what what unique you will feel about this it's like they're just going to make everything very easy for you okay even by just being them with you inspiring them talking them with you it's like uh, talking to talking to them is going to make a huge difference like how you see your world and they're just going to help you to see things from a positive perspective it's not just like they're just going to uh, here to love you but they're just going to be that person who is there for you and everything that you do they're just going to be very supportive but they're just going to help you shift your perspective to positive ones like how to carry these responsibilities that you have that how to carry your um position power the abilities the advantages ha you have uh, in a better way so you can just enjoy your life as well okay that's that's the difference that this person has okay uh, from other people what type of love five three is attracting their life hmm. again we have the head of and the judgment and the queen of cups and the three of swords and the seven of wands yeah bottom of the deck we have the two of two of swords as i already said you're going to you are you will have to choose between two person okay and with the head of end, judgment queen of cups and this person is not shy about being a, like a provider for you okay that if that's what you prefer they're just going to be like that 
huge support that you can conquer anything okay they are just going to be that one supporter that you can conquer the whole world because you have their support okay this person is going to be very supportive they are just going to be that pillar in your life where you can just rest easy okay you are just lean they are just going to be the you the and the shoulder that you can lean on okay you can uh, be uh, taken care of by them it's it's like they they love to take care of you it's like it's not just like babysitting or anything they just love to be supportive they just they love you so much that their love language would be like uh, act of service and they will be expressive of how they are feeling continuously with the three of swords they will help they will be there for you in every step of the way okay they will never show they will be always like they will never make fun of your um past or the things that you had to face in the past or like your problem is their problem okay they are just going to defend the whole world they you just is going to fight the whole world for you they are just they are just going to defend you because they know they know you as a person they know you are worth the weight you are the worth to fight for and uh, they will never leave your side okay with the queen of cups and why the queen of cups is here i don't know hmm. I feel like if uh, your parents and uh, the family member or your best friends or the 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 people that that you're close to they are going to love your person and they are just going to love how you guys are together they just yes with the four of pentacles uh, pentacles I feel like you are type of a person who are not uh, there to not uh, ready for a love connection or things like that but this person makes an exception in your life and it's going to surprise your family a lot and with the six of pentacle it's like i told you they are going to be very supportive they are going to be very generous with you with their wealth with their time with their efforts they are just going to show you how much they care for you okay it's all oh, this their their efforts are going to be consistent it's not like until they get you it's like going to be very like um, they are always going to be with this way for you why is this eight of swords is here they will help you empower uh, help you empower they will help you conquer your confidence back with the wheel of fortune i think they see you how much potential you carry pile number 3 if there is like a time they they it's like this person is going to help you activate that the true self energy that you carry that the the person that can achieve anything that they want they are just going to help you be that person okay magician and also this person is very charismatic and this person is going to make you feel like you have the whole world with you it's like anything is possible when you are with this person it's like they they can make everything possible they will do everything possible to help you get whatever you want and help you achieve the dream that you have and they are just um, they are just incredibly in love with you they are just going to sweep you off your feet they are just going to they will never they will never fail to impress you i don't know there is something did this person really want to impress you a lot it's like their energy what else anything else why the five of swords is here the page of cups this person or you are very sharp with your words okay you know how the the power of your words and if you don't like certain person or individual if you think that this person is not uh worth of your time or they are just disrespecting you're just repel back that energy to that person and you just uh, you are like uh, we don't deal with this negativity 
you just move forward and you just focus on what's uh, very important for you it's like you are very much into uh, of, uh, attracting a positive energy into your life and this person has the same energy and this person is going to be this uh, positive ray of uh, positive affirmation like a source of a positivity that even if your mind is telling you negative things about yourself this person is going to cheer you up in every step of the way the six of swords and you're going to conquer many things together you're going to grow a lot with together okay and this person is going to be like they will they they, they are not going to afraid to take charge like if you if you if you show that you you can't uh, help them or you can't uh, do something they're not just going to leave your side they will take you uh, with them and they they will they will always there by your side okay yeah. bottom of the deck we have the death card and your relationship also going to be very like um, intense and they are just uh, very uh, like a very intimate connection that you guys share together as I already said with the transformation you guys going to a uh, many transformation together you are you are going to grow as a person and also you are going to create this deeper bound to get deeper bonds with each other okay they're not going to uh, they're not just uh, they will never uh, ever overpower your uh, or ever try to uh, dim your light okay it's something it's very important in your connection that they never they will never try to dim your light even if you are um, more successful than they are if you have like more light than them they're just going to inspire to become more great version of you it's like that any last two cards okay hmm. with the five of cups in reverse with the tower in reverse and with the moon card and we have the world and we have the nine of pentacles bottom of the deck we have the star so five of cups in reverse like this is already as i already mentioned this person is going to take your worries and take your negative thoughts and emotions and they will trans they will help you to transform that into the positive ones they will always remind remind you how powerful how confident how amazing you are okay by number three See, messages are keep repeating that this person is going to help you every step of the way they will help you rise from the ashes like they are just going to be there for you always always like they see your potential they see your power so they want to make sure that you you become that virgin that has everything okay mm, with the chariot card this person is also very intuitive so they know uh, okay they have this uh, um, uh, they have this uh, like a unique quality that they this person understand very others emotions and what uh, people good uh, people are good at okay they know like what skill you should uh, pursue to or uh, what you should carry like what emotions or what things that you need to work on to get um whatever you desire okay or complete your goals or vision okay this person i feel like it's a i feel like they um, they may be um, a counselor okay they work as a counselor or uh, they, uh, they 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 are very good advisor also okay they will always give you good advice 
so you won't feel this kind of uh, negativity in life okay when you are with this person you are just going to feel very positive you are just going to almost forget your past and the negative things that ever happened to you you are just going to focus more on positive things and positive light and you are just going to be very surprised like how much uh, potential you have and this person that they will help you see the potential you have like they see in you okay that's what I feel. Uh, I hope um, messages resonates with you and I'll see you next time. Bye.